namo buddhaya dear meritorious devotees and my dear children have you ever experienced when you go to bed at night you feel tired or feel fatigued but still the sleep does not come to you have you ever experienced in the middle of the night you wake up by screaming by seeing a worst nightmare have you ever experienced when you get up in the morning you feel really really bad for no reason so these are the things these are the experience common experiences that we all face when we are going to sleep so it is very essential for a person to have a very good sleep but we hardly have a sound sleep that is why we feel so bad when we get up in the morning that is why the day get miserable when we have no sleep at night so as disciples of supreme buddha our great teacher supreme buddha taught us the path the way to have a very good sleep our great teacher supreme buddha advised us that if you practice love and kindness if you had a compassionate heart well built inside your heart you will have a very good sleep you can sleep better our great teacher supreme buddha told there are 11 benefits for a person who practice love and kindness among those 11 benefits the first one is our great teacher supreme buddha taught us he will have a very good sleep because of practicing love and kindness now imagine a night you go to sleep with hatred and anger in your mind can you sleep the sleep will not come to you that means the more we practice anger and hatred in our mind we will never have a good sleep in our day our great teacher supreme buddha taught us you should practice love and kindness if you practice this and if you develop love and kindness thoroughly in your heart if you practice love and kindness where you will never get angry with anyone even though they make troubles for you if you did not get angry you can sleep very well so that is the secret of having a very good sleep and also our great teacher supreme buddha taught us because of practicing love and kindness you will never see any nightmares you will have a continuous and very calm and serene sleep and also our great teacher supreme buddha told us if you practice love and kindness within your heart if you build up a compassionate heart when you get up early in the morning you will feel very refreshed when you feel refreshed in the morning your day will be refreshed your day will be amazing because how we start the day determines how we spend the day so the love and kindness compassion is affecting our lives in many ways that is why our great teacher supreme buddha taught us to practice the compassion love and kindness within our hearts if you need to sleep better you need to practice love and kindness so here is a practical way that you can have a very good sleep in each and every night when you go to bed you should do these things The first thing is that you should not go to bed without refreshing your body. Don't go to bed with sweat and dust-filled legs. You should refresh your body. 
you can have a shower or do whatever it takes. Do not go to bed with fatigue and sweat and tiredness. You should feel refreshed. That is the first part. The second step is, soon after you are on the bed, cross your legs or lie down or lay down or sit down. It doesn't matter. Be in a comfortable position. Close your eyes and take a deep breath in. Fill your lungs with fresh air and let them go away. Do this practice about three times. And as the third step, start to spread love and kindness, first of all, to yourself. Think of yourself and start to practice love and kindness to you. You can think like this. May I be free from anger. You will feel better when you are free from anger. When you wish to be free from anger. You can think, may I be free from ill will. May I be free from jealousy. All those evil thoughts like ill will, jealousy, hatred, anger makes your day miserable, makes your life miserable and it ruins your sleep. So what you have to do? You have to wish yourself that may I be free from all those evil things. Wish for yourself, may I be free from difficulties. May I be free from physical and mental suffering. Start loving yourself first. Start spreading compassion, love towards yourself first. Then you will feel better. You will feel relaxed. Then spread that love and kindness towards the people around you. Your father, your mother, your husband, and to your wife or whoever that lives around you. Spread your love and kindness to them. And expand that love and kindness step by step to the whole world. Finally, you can think, may all living beings in this whole universe be well and happy. May they be free from physical and mental suffering. Start spreading your love and kindness to all people, all living beings. And especially, start forgiving all the enemies of your life. If you hold on to anger, if you hold on to resentment, you will never have a good sleep. So what you have to do is, you should forgive all the enemies because we are not going to live forever in this world. We may, we may die one day. So when we are dying, when we face the death, we cannot take all these possessions that we have in our life. Start forgiving. Start spreading love and kindness to your enemies. Then you will feel relaxed. Continue this spreading love and kindness to all living beings until you fall asleep. And our great teacher Supreme Buddha taught us, if you practice love and kindness, if you build a heart which is filled with love and kindness and compassion, you can have a better sleep. And you will no longer see any nightmares in your, in your night at your sleep. And also, when you get up in the morning, you will feel refreshed. Then your day will be refreshed and your life will be a wonderful one. Practice love and kindness and sleep better. Namo Buddhaya.